Hey, my name is Connor and welcome to Crypto Empire, where we dominate the crypto market. In this video, we'll be going over BitTensor and the Tau coin, which right now is about to break through $200. This is a brand new all-time high at $199. Looking at the price chart, it has gone parabolic and there's nothing but clear skies ahead. 87% of all the Tau in circulation is staked. There is very little float out there to go ahead and buy on the open market. And the major centralized exchanges that will be listing this in the future have no choice but to buy it from the open market. And on top of that, the network continues to grow with new subnets launching every single week. So in this video, I'll be giving an update about the BitTensor network as well as the Tau price outlook. It's time to get into it and let the gains be with you. So first things first, CoinGecko has officially listed Tau's market cap, so we no longer have to rely on TauStats.io to see the market cap. And right now the market cap of Tau is $1.127 billion. It cracked a billy, and it has also flipped render in market cap. And right now it's all gas, no brakes. I don't see this letting up as more people are beginning to realize that BitTensor is the true decentralized artificial intelligence network on the blockchain. Also some breaking news from OpenAI. They actually decided to fire Sam Altman and they went ahead and appointed the former CTO, this guy Mira Murati, as the new CEO. So yeah, this is what corporate America is all about. The guy who created the company eight years ago has been ousted by the board for whatever reason, welcome to centralized corporate entities. And also the second in command guy at OpenAI also decided to leave after he learned that Sam Altman had been let go. So this is a beautiful thing for decentralized artificial intelligence projects such as BitTensor because it's only gonna get more exposure as more people realize that OpenAI has a lot of flaws and we're gonna see what's gonna happen now with this new leadership transition. Will OpenAI and ChatGPT be able to have the same growth trajectory that they've experienced so far? Time is going to tell, but this is really bullish in my opinion for Tau. Now in regards to this breaking news about OpenAI, Tau basically immediately started to pump and break through the previous highs at around $170. It's about to crack through 200. Let's take a look at what Dread Bongo has to say about when it breaks $200. He says that things are going to get very real, very fast. There's nothing but air above these clouds. Now imagine exchanges having to scramble and get every single last Tau available in order to list it on their centralized exchanges, having no option but to organically buy their tokens on the books before their rivals do. You don't ignore a project that rose to the top 50 out of nowhere. You pay very close attention. And I do agree with Dread Bongo on this statement. And yeah, there's really nothing but buying pressure. 87, 88% of all the Tau in circulation is currently staked. There's very little available float out there. The only way to get your hands on Tau is to mine it directly or you can buy it from exchanges. It's a beautiful thing when a project does a fair launch without any VCs, without a big pre-sale, you have to basically become a part of the community and buy it or mine it just like everybody else. And the projects that have done fair launches like this Tau, also Caspa, it's a beautiful thing. When VCs don't have billions of dollars to go ahead and dump on retail, it's organic, true price action. And yeah, Tau is just getting started in my opinion. Congratulations to everybody that's been paying attention to my channel. I've been talking about Tau from August. I mean, I was kind of late to my entry at around 50 to $60, but looking at the price now, doesn't seem like I was late at all. I know many people were earlier than me, such as guys like Dread Bongo and a lot of other people on Twitter, but nonetheless, I feel very comfortable with my position and it's a beautiful thing to see this project's growth so far. So in regards to Tau, what it is, so it's a decentralized neural network. It has two layers to it. It has the mining layer, which actually goes ahead and trains the artificial intelligence models. Then it has the validator layer. Okay, and the validator actually validates the AI and it makes sure that the best AI models getting trained by the miners get compensated. And here we can see another tweet by our guy Dread Bongo, one of the biggest Tau bulls, one of the earliest Tau bulls on Twitter. So he's saying here, Foundry are the third largest validator on the BitTensor network. They are also the largest Bitcoin miners in the world with a 28.3% share of the hash rate. Okay, so essentially what the BitTensor Foundation went ahead and did over the kind of the original months after the project launched until recently, they went ahead and they wanted to make sure that the network was decentralized. 
So how they did that was they went to the biggest Bitcoin miners out there and they got them to start mining Tau to decentralize the network. Now the foundation is more focused on their AI models and making sure that the artificial intelligence products are being developed so that the AI is really good and you know people are going to want to use it compared to the centralized counterparts out there such as OpenAI and ChatGPT. So it's a beautiful thing when we have a decentralized network and we also have validators actually validating the AI models to make sure that the cream rises to the top. And this is what all the subnets are. Each one of these subnets has a different use case. To access them, you need Tau, okay? So Tau has a flywheel effect in its use case and it's only gonna be growing from here. Now let's take a look at this tweet by the Tensor Detective, another OG in the Tau community. He says, it gets interesting when all 32 subnets are filled and subnet wars begin. Miners competing, validators competing, subnets competing. Everything in the BitTensor ecosystem is driven by the need to compete, accelerate, innovate, and add value is the only way to remain. Dollar sign, Tau. All right, so it's a great time to be a Tau holder if you're just getting into the community right now. I don't think it's too late. I see this as a four-figure coin and possibly a five-figure coin after the music stops when the bull run is at its peak. I am very, very bullish on this coin. It's actually the largest holding in my portfolio after Caspa. And number three now has become Cubic as well, which is another AI coin I'm bullish on. I bought my Cubic between $600 to $700 per billion, and now it's trading for $3,342 per billion. I let everybody know first in my Discord, and then I posted it as well in my free Telegram group. So get in the free Telegram group if you're not already in it. I told everybody in my live streams about Cubic as well when it was down here at $600 per billion. And I posted it on Twitter as well. So follow me on Twitter, guys. We are crushing it right now. The portfolio just keeps on going up, making new highs after new highs every single day. And I do expect this to continue as the accumulation phase we are in ends and we enter into the actual bull market. So BitTensor Tau, back to the subject of this video, very bullish on the coin, bullish on it going forward. Definitely join the Tau Discord, their official Discord. Uh, we can take a look at all the subnets here and then also the Tau Community Discord as well is a really good resource for anybody that wants to go ahead and learn more about the network. A lot of really smart people in here willing to answer any questions and help everybody out in the Tau Community Discord as well as the official BitTensor Discord channel. All right, guys, so this was just a quick update about Tau. I hope you enjoyed the video. In regards to the price chart, if you're looking for pullbacks, I'm not sure we do get them, right? There's nothing but buying pressure. The majority of Tau is staked. We can take a quick look at Tau stats here and see that 87.6% of all Tau in circulation is staked. And if you actually go ahead and delegate, you earn 17.81% APY on your stake Tau, which is insane. That means if you stake 100 Tau, you're getting yourself 17.8 Tau in rewards every single year at the current emissions rate. So it's a beautiful thing. I definitely recommend it if you own Tau to stake it. There is no undelegation period. It's an instant unstake which is great. So yeah, in regards to the chart and pullbacks, look, I'm not sure we do get them, but you know, if we do, I assume they're gonna be very shallow dips, right? If we take a look at the, the pullbacks here, so this pullback from high to low, 18.7%, this pullback from high to low, 18, 19%. All right, so anything above a 15% pullback, I'm not sure we get much more than that. And a 15% pullback from current price would take the price to around $170. So do with that information what you will. If you don't wanna miss calls like this, because listen, I was very vocal about buying Tau down here between 50 to $60. If you don't believe me, go watch my old YouTube videos from back in August and September. But nonetheless, I am running a Black Friday sale on my premium Discord. You can get access. All information is on my Whoop page down below. You get one year access to the Discord. You get to talk to me directly for 30 minutes on the phone to structure your portfolio. You get access to my trading course. So if you're looking to capitalize fully on this crypto bull market and reach your personal goals, this is an amazing step in the right direction. I definitely recommend you check it out. Using the first link down in the description below, it will take you to my Whoop page. Nonetheless, I hope you enjoyed this video. Cheers to all the towel holders out there. We have a lot to look forward to here going forward into the future. So this was a quick update video about BitTensor Tau. The Tau coin is about to crack through $200. Things are getting really interesting here. And I think we have a lot to look forward to here going forward into the future. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you let me know by smashing that like button down below. If you're brand new to Crypto Empire and you're not already subscribed to the channel, go ahead right now and smash that subscribe button down below and turn on all bell notifications so that you don't miss any future videos. 
check out my Black Friday sale using the first link down in the description below, and I'll see you in the next video.